Hi guys, welcome back to Pokemon's 2018 European Journeyman here at HNK Sibenek or Sibenek in Croatia. Um, just coming in now, I was, I'm actually bringing this in a little bit earlier than I would like. I'll, I'll tell you what's happened so far, but I want to show you something. Um, we're supposedly uh, going to be having a takeover at some point soon. Now, takeovers are both fun and exciting um they're also a little bit treacherous so there is a good chance that if we do get taken over and a chairman comes in he may want to chip us off and get rid of us and bring in his own manager um we've only just arrived here we're free at this moment in time we're three games in um but we have only just arrived here i want to spend at least two seasons here really Especially with how things are looking at the minute. So it says we're sixth in the Croatian second league. Now we picked up in ninth place when we got here. Um, if we look at the schedule, so we came in here, Mitch and Mjurge, um, and we won 2 1. Opening game for us, fantastic start. We then took on Solin. Solin was second place when we took him on. We beat him 2 1. We then took on Novigrad. Novigrad, after we beat Solin, went into second place. We beat them 2-0. And if we look at the Croatian second league, we're in the sixth place, we're on 36 points. Solon and Novigrad, the teams in um, the second automatic promotion place and the playoff place, are only five points ahead of us. Five points ahead of us, and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight games left to go. So, um, there is a chance that our first half season, shall we say, here in Croatia, could um, end up with a second promotion for us. So back-to-back -back promotions for this manager. How about that? That's pretty fucking good, isn't it? Um, the thing I wanted to talk about in the last episode was the rules of the league. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to have a quick look at the rules of the league now. So... 12 teams, points for a win free, number of matches, 33 games, we've worked that one out. No more than 5 non-EU players in the playing 11. Must be at least 3 under 21 players in the playing 11 for the first half of the game. Match squad cannot have more than 5 players aged over 21. B teams only. Alright, so that only applies to the B teams, that's fine. 7 subs named, maximum 3 used, no trials allowed to play in matches. League sorting rules, results between teams, goal differences... Goals scored, team records against other teams on the same points to be sorted by the rules in the following order, away goals scored. Top team wins promotion to the first league, but B teams are not allowed to be promoted from this division. Uh, team in second position qualifies for promotion playoff. Okay, so what's the third? Oh, right, okay, yeah, I can understand it now. So because of the top team, um, which is the B team, they're, they're winning, but they can't get promoted. So second place is going to get automatic promotion. Third place, if they were in second place, would get the qualification spot. So, yeah. Um, got it. One match banned for every three yellow cards. One match banned for every red card. Uh, wage rule is £90 per week minimum for full-term players 16 years old and up. Maximum six players allowed on long-term loans. From the same club in a season. Okay. So, I mean, obviously we're, we're complying to those rules. But Dynamo 2 or Dynamo B are currently in first place. I can't see us catching up. I can't see us catching up with Dynamo uh, 2. But we could catch up with Solon and Novigrad. I mean, this league, there isn't much in it. I mean, even 11th place, um, who are on 20 points, theoretically could. Uh, more than seven games ago, mathematically, they could still win. But I don't think it's happening. Zagreb maybe could still. But we're definitely in the chance of getting promotion. Not necessarily, we're not going to win the league, but we've we got a good chance of getting second. Um, and that would be good. I am going to bugger off for a bit. We're going to come back for the Dynamo 2 game. And that will be this episode done. So I will see you after a very, very quick, sexy cut.
Hi guys, so yeah, um, it's been another day since you saw the rest of the episode. Um, we have pushed on to the Dynamo 2 game. Um, this is a muslin, this is a baby, we're doing it this way. She may kick off. You know what it's like recently. Um, I'm going with a 4231 wide. Um, it's counter in a minute and structured. I'm, I'm thinking I will probably end up changing it to the uh, 433. I want to just put it onto this. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Let's do it now. Uh, we're not going to go with that. We're going to go with this. Um, hello. What are you doing? You were happy. Why aren't you happy now? Um, the reason I changed it up is because the team said, well, you know, it's Dynamo 2 at the top of the league. Um, we're actually favourites for this game, weirdly enough. Um, if we go back to... I've got to go back for a lot of stuff here now. I've done a few things. Oh, there we go. There we go. So, our recent form is strong. They apparently don't have a recent form. Probably something to do with them being a, a B team, shall we say. Um, but we're favourites. Um, but they're 20 points ahead of us in the league. They've only lost three games all season. Sibalia, Luco, and Solin. Um, talking about Luco, we beat them 4 0. Away. Not bad. Not bad. Um, the team seems to still seem to think we're, you know, below them, despite the fact we've had a good start. But, I mean, this has gone sort of dark red. I'm assuming that means it's about to sort of dip that way if we get a good result. Oh, what's the matter? I'm assuming it means it's going to dip that way if we get a good result. Um, at least I hope that's, that's the case. I'm, I'm hoping that's what it means. I haven't really looked into it. I need to work it out. Um... But the dressing room match feels good. Only one player is unhappy, and that's Musa. But he's second string wing back or left back. He's actually good. Um, for for our level, I mean, look at his physicals. And, I mean, he's actually good. Potential ability is four star. But he plays the same position as Perika Serre, whose physicals are immense. He's 28 years old. His current ability is better. And he's playing like fucking... Like it's really well. 8.4 in the last game. 7.5. 7.6. 7. He's, the last four games, he's been getting sevens and above. So, you know, it's, it's a case of do we drop someone we know is playing well in order to facilitate someone who's unhappy? Um, you playing ball, sweetheart? Because we're about to. If you could just be good. So we're going to head into the match. What's, what's, what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Um, we're going to head into the match. I'm Ow, that was my tongue. I just bit my tongue. Again. It's already slightly swollen. So I bit it hard the other day. Um, come on, let's see what we can do. Because we're favourites, we're second in the form table there first. Um, I don't really know how to play this. Let's go with, I know if a lot of you want to get revenge. Oh, oh, but we've got burps out of here. Hey, look. Babies, mate, I tell you. Babies. So, let's go ahead and select our... Let's go over and insert. There's a lot more to come. Midfield passion at this time. There's a lot more to come. And for the strikers, we're going to go with Anna Sertev. Uh, there's a lot more to come. And then we're going to go straight into it. Kick things off with a concentrate. So, we are still five points behind second and third. Uh, Solin and... I can't remember the other team now. But... Hey! <laughs> one nil up. Um, but if we keep the pressure on, we've got seven games. Um, if we keep the pressure on, we can do it. We're not going to beat Dynamo. Seven games, it's 21 points. They're already 20 points ahead of us. Obviously, if we win here, they'll be 17 points ahead of us. But the six games, 18 points. It's, you know, you do the maths. They're going to get the one or two points they need to win the league. But... It does mean second and third places are up for grabs. Second and third place, second place automatic promo. Third place is qualification. And we can do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Let's go push forward. We're dominating. Um, three shots compared to their zero. We've had decent possession. Midfield is being outnumbered by their midfield. Okay, well, we'll what can we do? I'm, I'm not changing the tactic up. No chance. No chance of that happening. We're, we're going to carry on. That's where I score a goal. Clearance. And we're... No, I was about to say we're on a counter-attack, but we could be. Here comes Marlis, the out of... Oh, 
the out of position player is what I was about to say. He's not really a poacher, but he's getting played there. So he needs to. Uh, um, what did I say about our possession? Doesn't matter. They've just scored. Shit. But, I mean, even a draw here brings us ahead of uh, Major Merger, um, who I think drew their game. Uh, so why are we ahead of them? Is it because we beat them? I'm assuming it's because we beat them in the last game. Because it did say that um, results against the teams are more of a deciding factor than goals, didn't it? I'm sure that's what it said in the rules when we last looked. Go over concentrate. I do want to win this match, obviously. Um... Because this will give me a massive confidence boost. If we beat first place, this is basically the Dinamo Zagreb reserve team. They're going to be the best team in the league. Um, but beating them is definitely going to... Oh, hello. Ah, oh, Malice. Um, beating them is definitely going to be a nice, you know, confidence boost. Um, and it increases our chance of getting a promotion this season. Something I didn't think that was going to be on the cards, you know. Not originally. The fact it could be on a card is um, is rather nice. You know, back-to-back -back promotions, two different clubs. Not many managers can claim that. It's good. It's good. Right. Has it? Well, I've actually... Right, so I've had to approach to sign him. Um, so I've put in a contract. He's, got, he's accepted it. The only problem is we don't have any money. And I've had to give him 15 grand up front because we can't offer him more than 700 quid a week. Um, and he wanted a grand. Yakovic or Jerkovic, because I praised him. He had a seven point something, um, I think it was like seven point eight rating after the last game. I was like, Yeah, you know, mate, you've done really well. You've done, you done fantastically, fantastically. You played, played out your skin. I was like, I didn't play that well. All right, mate, fucking calm down. Don't be a cunt. You fucking jerk, Ovic. All right, let's go over constant. No, not get creative. No, I accidentally clicked get creative. Um, I wanted a concentrate, an orange juice concentrate. I don't know, just a concentrate. What are you doing, eh? So, we go into the, uh, the second half, 2-1 up. That is good news. They're not really taking much notice of things at the minute. It's played so far, well so far. Room for improvement. Defence, passionate. There's not more to come from you. Oh, 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 oh. Why does she need to do this? Why doesn't the wife help? Right. I'm joking. The wife has worked hard. I just need to get this recorded. Uh, a lot more to come from you. There we go. End of team talk. Lovely. The wife's actually having a well-deserved rest. Um, I just want to get this done because I like. I'm. I'm having a lot of fun and enjoyment out of the save at the minute, and I can't stop playing it. As of today, I am. Oh. Not bad. I, I'm actually two weeks ahead of my recordings. <laughs> so you'll be seeing this two weeks. I mean, I'm, this is like Monday, not Monday, sorry, Wednesday the 6th of December I'm recording this. So when you see it, you'll be like, fuck me, why is well ahead? I know, I'm well ahead. I am. And talking to babies, like I'm silly. Yes, I am. Because um, I am a silly Billy. And so are you. Um, <laughs> let's bring off Marlers. Marlers is not having a good one. And bring on Medven. I don't know why. I mean, we could bring Stipe Maritich on. Or Maritich. Uh, who else is playing reasonably poorly? Why are you doing that again? Let's bring on Yusuf Musa. Because, well, you know, left backs. Our left backs looking tired. He's got perfect morale, yet he's unhappy. Work out one out. Um, we'll also bring on Roglic into the middle for Celic. He's a DM, I know he's a DM, he's not a CM. But honestly, the guy has got some, some potential. I may have to retrain him as a CM just to fit this tactic. Um, well, I'll have a look at things going forward. I'll have to look look into it. It's just... He does look good. Um, I am... I've got to wait until we've got money. Or the potential takeover bid comes in. I really, really, hello, well done, Stanich. I really, really want to raid Ozipovici. Well, I want to, I want to get Tupolov, but Tupolov's not at Ozipovici anymore. I can't remember who we moved to. I do want to bring him into the team. And I also want to bring Azeski into the team. 
Just because I want to bring him with me. It's a freak. Go. Okay, what well Umbracalo? Oh, it was Medvin. Oh, it weren't a freak girl. That was a cross, was it? Let's have a look at this again. So Musa with the throw. Finds Bracalo. Plays it. Medvin. Little. Oh, he had a little sort of turning, glancing header. Redirected it. That's good. That is good. That's the kind of play I like to see from my teams. It is. It's starting to snort. It's starting to fall asleep now. It's good. It's good news for me anyway. It's good news for you. So, last five or so minutes. Just going to go concentrate. Okay, it was seven minutes, more or less. Um, Stanis pumps up. I've got four minutes of injury time. Great ball. Great ball. Let's just hold on to this win now, please, guys. I, I, I would appreciate it if we don't concede another goal as well. I need to work on my goal difference. I haven't gone... Met Oh, Medven. Lovely. 4-1 against Dinamo 2. The first placed Dinamo 2. The Dinamo 2, we don't have to worry about finances or anything like that. Dinamo 2. <laughs> oh, I'll keep going. What are you doing? You were just about to fall asleep. And now you're not. Because, I don't know. Uh, uh, uh. What are you smiling? Oh, you, you're smiling. You're, you're scream smiling. You're smile screaming. You're smeming. You're smeming. There we go. Musa, just hoof it. Hoof it. Why are you just... Why are you dicking around on a ball? Just just get rid of the cunt. Just... That's it. Oh, what's the matter, darling? What's the matter? Just... She's been a bit ill. Okay. That's all. She's been a bit ill the last couple of days. You can't do anything with babies when they're this young. All right. Anyway, guys. Um, that was not a bad win. She is definitely going to kick off any second now. So I'm going to call an end to the episode. Um, Iris, come on now. Um, if you have enjoyed today's episode, of course, please do go ahead, like and subscribe. Uh, if you haven't yet subscribed. Um, if, <laughs> if you haven't yet subscribed, please do go ahead and do so. If you enjoyed today's video, please do uh, give us a thumbs up. Um, if you can wish baby little Iris here, little baby Iris, you know, getting better. Wish you well. Wish you well, Iris, because... Uh, at the minute, mummy and daddy aren't getting much sleep because of it. Um, or much anything else in the bedroom uh, because of it. And, um, yeah. Anyway, guys, you take care. Enjoy me for the next episode. And I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye.